Nearly all pregnant women have more vaginal discharge during pregnancy than when they're not pregnant. That's because the increased levels of estrogen during pregnancy cause more mucus secretion from vaginal tissues. Normal secretions during a healthy pregnancy are typically thin and white and do not smell foul or fishy. Sometimes, however, the discharge is the result of an infection or other problem. So for example, if you see thick, white, chunky discharge, that could be a yeast infection. Fishy, smelling, gray, and thin discharge can be bacterial vaginosis. Green, thin discharge, often itchy, can be trichomonas, which is a sexually transmitted infection. Yellow mucousy discharge, which is actually coming from the cervix instead of the vagina, can be a sign of cervicitis. If you think you have any of these, or if the discharge is associated with fever or pelvic pain or abnormal bleeding, see your doctor. As you get closer to delivery, there are other types of discharge you may experience. The mucus plug that has been protecting your cervix from outside infection will be expelled. When it comes out, it looks like mucus from blowing your nose. That may simply seem like increased discharge. Of course, the discharge you may be the most concerned about is amniotic fluid or your water breaking. This tends to be more voluminous than any other kind of discharge. If you think your water has broken, contact your provider immediately. You may really be going into labor. An increase in vaginal discharge, though, is completely normal. Almost every prenatal patient I see wonders about it. If you're curious to know more, don't hesitate to ask your doctor or midwife.